Left was the last team selected into the D2 playoffs as they face Colorado School of Mines. Cougars open the game with a 75-yard drive and cap it off with six. Caden Walters fakes the run and flips to Thurl Reist over for the three-yard TD. USF up 7-0. Then later in the first, the Cougar going to double up their lead as Jatai Jenkins slips through the line, makes a man miss, and he'll motor 40 yards into Pater. That was the longest run the Ore Digger defense had given up all season. But that mark wouldn't last long. Head to the third quarter, up 7 and Rice Storfer is going to find a huge hole on the left side. He'll get to the outside, and he's gone. 74 yards for the touchdown as USF goes back on top by 14 points. But in the fourth quarter, Mines now down seven, and they'll pull even. John Matoka hits Garrett Hiles for the eight-yard touchdown. That caps off a 96-yard drive and ties the game up at 21. And then the Ore Diggers would have a chance for the go-ahead field goal late as Scott Marshall splits the uprights from 23 yards out. And Colorado School of Mines scores seven. 17 unanswered as they end USF season 24-21.